Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Chiropractic Has Failed Me. And uh, so, so you guys remember Gracie, and uh, last time we talked, not on video, but last time we talked, you had said there were some improvements mm -hmm. in a couple of spots, but mm -hmm. we're just not where we want to be. So keep sending her love, keep sending her good thoughts and, and, and prayers. So what, what are you feeling today? Lower back left, which is usually it's the right. So that's weird. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. How's the upper back? Upper back's not bad. That's impressive. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And you had some neck issues yeah, earlier, too. Yeah, I think too. I pulled something in my neck oh, this morning. This morning? Yeah. Out, you felt it after you woke up? or yes, or after I woke up. It, okay. wasn't, it wasn't immediate, either. It was... Okay. So. Is it hard to turn your head? Yes. Stand, stand equal weight on both feet for a second. And let me see you turn your head to the left. Any pain? No. Turn to the right. Yes. You turn to me, you turn to the right. Yeah. Now bend to the left, ear to shoulder. Any pain? No. Bend to the right. Yep. Yeah, that one's limited. That didn't go as far as the other side. Now look up at the ceiling and see if there's pain. Mm, not really look. pain. It's kind of pulling a little bit. Okay. Look down at the floor. No. Nothing. So when you look up and you feel the pulling, point to where it pulls the most. Right. Got it. So it's the right side of her, uh, of the back of her neck, right, right back here. Yeah. So yeah, all right. Right here. Got it. So let's have you lie on your back, face up. I'm gonna stand on this side, and we're gonna check. So so many times when your neck locks up, everybody's experienced this, right? Where you, you, you say, I slept funny, or I, all I did was turn my head and everything locked up, but my neck got stiff. A lot of times it's because a rib popped out of place, and all the muscles around it up to the neck went into spasm and tightened up. So I'm gonna check the ribs on the right side of your upper back, slide down a little bit. Good, and give yourself a big giant hug. Nice job. You're not working today, huh? No, I took off today. Good. All right. Found it. Mm -hmm. That's tender, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So what I'm going to do is contact it, and we're going to pull it back into place. Take a deep breath. Breathe out. Did you hear that mm -hmm. pop in? Very good. Less tender when I press? Yes. Okay. Anything lower, like here? A little bit, yeah. All right, let's do that one as well. Deep breath, breathe out. Good. She is a trooper and a champion because rib adjustments are painful sometimes. So maybe because you guys are here, she's not really normally maybe, maybe just kidding. She's always a trooper. Put your hands behind your neck, interlock your fingers. I'm gonna go to the same spot. The second one didn't move as much as I wanted it to. So right there, it was here, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, breathe in, breathe out. I think that one did it. All right. Before I adjust your neck or anything else, stand up and let's see if you can, because turning to the right, bending to the right was painful. So turn your head to the right. It still hurts a little bit. Bend to the right. I can bend more, but okay. still hurts. Look up again. Does it still pull That's the, better. That one's better? Yeah. All right, line your back again. Let's look at your neck. Good. Don't try this at home. <laughs> How do you pop your rib out? You know, ribs move when we breathe. That's a wonderful question. So ribs are like bucket handles. You know those paint buckets that have a handle that hangs on the side? So if these are ribs on the sides of the rib cage, when we inhale, they go up. Rib cage expands. They come down when we exhale. Okay. So as they're moving up and down, where the back of them are attached to the rib to the spine right as they move up and down if there's a misalignment in the spine the uh, rib can pop out uh, but the thing is she'll keep breathing so now it's not in place anymore it's sitting out here and it keeps going up and down and it irritates all of that and all the muscles tense up yeah. this is where it's tender correct all right so we are going to rotate c2 tilt your head back a little we're going to bring it up and in very gentle Good. I think we woke up the neighbors with that one. You know which neighbors? Canada and Mexico. <laughs> woke them up. Is it less painful? Yeah. Wonderful. All right. Tell them what you did this morning. Uh oh. That Tell me what you did. I Tell everybody. We got a thousand uh, people listening. I made pizza? No. Oh, what? What your girlfriend gave you, which I did not agree with. 
Oh, I still get 800 milligram ibuprofen. Oh, I see. Well, for because of the neck or yeah. because of the low back? Well, both. Both, okay. Isn't that not good? With just a, a granola bar for on her stomach. <laughs> Everybody's wondering, who's that talking? I know. <laughs> We're not going to tell you. It's I'm ghost. not allowed. It's, it's a secret. It's but it, it's It's somebody who knows her very well, so she's, she's allowed. Um, yeah, uh, let me address that in a second. I want to move this phone first. All right. You know, your neck's going to move so well, next week we'll be able to turn your head all the way around. <laughs> you'll, you'll be in the movie Exorcist. <laughs> all right, so right side or both? Both. Okay, shrug your shoulders and down. Shrug up and down, again, and down. Just relax, all the way down, good. All right, so 800 milligrams seems to be the maximum that you should ever take. In one sitting, yeah, I mean, it, you just don't wanna do it more than once a day, and you don't wanna do it multiple days in a row. So having said that, the disclaimer is that I'm not a medical doctor, mm -hmm. so I don't, didn't you know, I don't understand. It didn't take away the pain. So. So if, it's, if the cause of the pain is pure inflammation, it'll feel fantastic and all the pain will go away. If the cause of the pain is not inflammation, if it's nerve impingement or a muscle spasm, it's not gonna help. Mm -hmm. And in her okay. case, it was bone out of place, pressing mm -hmm. on the nerve. So let's adjust your low back now. Um, turn over on your stomach. Thank you for that. It's My pleasure. Of course. Because I'm very conservative about medications. Good for you. That's why we get along so well, you and I. <laughs> and we both want this young lady to feel better and be healthy. And you say that out of concern, and I know that. In fact, that should go for all you guys at home, is if medication had no side effects, we'd be giving them to our children even when they're healthy. Mm -hmm. So the fact that we want to make sure we avoid it at all costs is because there is harm to every medication. Obviously, if you're on a prescription drug and your doctor prescribed it, your doctor has your best interest at heart and you need to follow their recommendations. <laughs> but your goal is to hang in there. My thumb's gonna come out the other side in a minute. Anyway, you know what? If if I if I cause enough pain down here, she'll forget about the neck pain. Yeah. You see, and then she'll yeah. say, "He's a genius." Yeah. <laughs> sounds like come on. Sounds like and a the deal. comedian. And the comedian. <laughs> you guys know how many chiropractors it takes to change a light bulb? I told you this one already, didn't I? I, th I think. But go ahead. Do you know? <laughs> Just one, but the light bulb has to come in three times a week. <laughs> okay, rise up, let's see. Stand tall. <laughs> let's see you turn your head to the right. I'm so broken. Well, we certainly, those rib adjustments were tough. Bend your head that Actually, way. Actually, yeah, that's better. Good, and turn. I just feel more loose. Good. I mean, it still kind of hurts. It still kind of hurts. But it's probably just going to take a little while. Let's see. Turn around. Face the window. I mean, if, you're, if I'm being honest. <laughs> well, we want her to be honest, don't we, guys? We want her to be honest. It's not so much. That's not where it hurts? Uh, okay. That one's kind of more like... This one? Yeah. Right there. Yeah, right there. Okay, so bend your head to the right three times. Good, keep going. Now turn your head to the right three times. Good, and now try it and see if that made a difference. Just, yeah, a little bit. Yeah, actually it did. All right, so you're gonna have to ice this okay. to reduce, reduce some of the swelling from the adjustment. Um, I'll see you again in two days. Okay. We're gonna go over and do the traction for the lower back, but we're not gonna make you watch that because you've already seen it multiple times. Any last parting words for our audience <laughs> here? Share, right? Wish Subscribe, wish her well, <laughs> right? Pray for her and all of that. We'll see you guys later.